Hi, I'm Ruby. I'm in fifth grade and I'm 10 years old. I want to be an ornithologist when I grow up. An ornithologist is a scientist that studies birds. I love birds. I love them because they are very beautiful and they have the freedom to fly as high as they can. They are so fun to watch because you never know what they are going to do. When I was younger, I went to my grandpa's ranch and he pointed out all kinds of birds. He showed me what they did and had me listen to the sounds they made. I bought a bunch of bird books and read them, and he bought me my own pair of binoculars. In case you didn't know much about birds, I'm going to teach you a little bit about them. Birds are warm-blooded animals that have feathers and lay eggs. Well, you probably know that, huh? Most people think they're just flying creatures, but trust me, they're much more than that. The bird I'm going to be talking to you about is the chimney swift. The chimney swift is a bird that lives mostly in the eastern part of North America. During the winter, they migrate to South America. That's a long way. It's more than 3,000 miles. And they do that twice a year. Whoa! When swifts are babies, they are called swiftlings. I learned from Mr. Rich that the chimney swift species is a declining species. That means that more and more chimney swifts are losing their homes and less and less chimney swifts are living. They are called chimney swifts because they live and roost in hollow places like dead trees and chimneys. As old chimneys are removed, there are fewer places for the birds to live and raise their babies. That's why we want to ask the mayor to let us put up a chimney swift tower, which isn't really a chimney at all, but it looks like one to the swifts and they love them. My little sister Tatum drew these two pictures showing a chimney swift with a hump and one without a hump. Aren't they cute? Did you know that you can make a difference in the lives of these little chimney swifts? You can do so by writing letters to your mayor so he will say yes to allowing chimney swift towers to be set up in your city. First, you write a letter with the following information. Dear Mayor, I believe that there should be chimney swift towers set up in our city because chimney swifts need homes that won't get capped so they can continue to enjoy life and contribute to our environment. Thank you for your help. Your friend, Ruby Shinesley. Step one, write the letter in your own words. Step two, decorate it. Step three, put the stamp on and address the letter. Step four, mail it and you're done. Now turn to your friend and give them a high five. You deserve it.